So it's 12 o'clock and I just got here to the vet. Um, tsunami went into labor um, about an hour and a half ago and Dr. Miller was very quick to say, get on the road and get here. I'll get someone in the office and take care of everything. So we just arrived, they brought her back. They're getting our girl ready um, and sedated and they're gonna bring me back when she uh, starts to pull out some of the puppies. So we'll keep you posted. YouTube, YouTube, what's good? It's your boy 247. Hey, look, check this out. So it's 11.35 p.m. January 1st. I was actually on my way to the casino. Man, my girl called me. She was like, I think it's going down. I think it's going down. So keep in mind, I'm like two hours away. I'm an hour away from my house, and the vet is an hour away from my house. So she like, we got to get it. So she was on the way. <sighs> she on the way to the vet. I'm on the way to the vet. She's actually already there. She beat me there because she had an hour head start. So I'm rushing to the joint. Um, obviously, I'm not going to be able to get no footage because I'm not there. And she's going to be, she already, she's probably already taking her back for the procedure. But hopefully, hopefully my girl gets some some footage and and yeah. But, but either way, y'all going to see when the pups pop out because I'm going to be there in about 20, 30 minutes. So yeah. I'm excited. We about to get it. Exotic French Boutique. Hey, make sure you subscribe, like my shit, go watch some past videos and all that. Yeah, Exotic French Boutique. All right, y'all, I'm here. I just pulled up. I'm 15 minutes late. The puppies popped already. It's five of them. I'm a little disappointed that I wasn't here. I made a bad judgment, but let's get it. She's still back there. I know we haven't seen it yet. Whoa, they're tiny. They're tiny. Here, This guy's little. Yeah. yeah, he's a little guy. Well, as you can see, she, he did. She had one in the birth canal. Yeah. The one was in the birth canal. Yeah. This one. This one's feisty. This yeah. one's feisty. And this he said it's what? Two. How many boys? How many girls? Two boys, three girls. Two boys, three girls. All girls. That's a boy over here. Um, I, I don't recall which ones are which. Is he breathing? All girls. Yeah, but he has to have some oxygen to help him. It's okay, little buddy. So, what they said to do that? Just helps open up the lungs a little bit. Okay. And what is that? It's called Dofran. Is he gonna be okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. I hope so. Okay. I mean he's breathing. Okay. But he is small, so he does yeah. have you know a little bit of a disadvantage. Yeah. But I'm hoping yeah. that he'll come around. Okay. Sometimes with these runs it can take a little bit longer too just to get him up and going. Okay. Oh yes, come on. We hear you. Come on, little buddy. Mm -hmm. 
I know. We hear the rest of you guys, though. <laughs> we do. All right, I hear you. You're still being feisty over here. And this one said, shut up. <laughs> I kicked him. He said, be quiet. You're my bunk mate. That's okay. We hear you. I know. We hear you. Come on, baby. Yes. Yes. My baby back there. I need to see my baby. I know. She's good, though. Look at y'all, looking like daddy. He's got some strong jeans. I can't wait to reach out to her and let her know, look, that guy's got some strong jeans. Yeah, look at you. What do you do with your big head? Oh man, you got a big old dome, don't you? Yes, you do, buddy. Oh, buddies. Look at her. Look at them. They're like wrestling. What are you guys doing over here, you crazy guys? Yeah, look at you. You're the, yeah, you feisty, huh? Yeah, you are. Look at the little ears. Come on, little ones. <laughs> we got all That's so funny. Okay, there you go. I know. There you go. Yeah. I know. I think he's whining now. They're so cute. The little one is still.
Okay. Now we're after. After he said after, right? Okay. Let's see. Oh, bring, did we bring him now? Or? Huh? Oh, okay. Who do we see? She's like knocked out. Yeah. So she's a baby. She's not me, baby. Okay. Oh, we baby. It's okay, you two. Because I don't think that's okay. Yep, I got him. Because I don't think the little one will nurse quite yet. Okay. Sorry, Sean. Love me. Two, two. All right, calm down, calm down, calm down. Little guy coming out, little guy coming through. There's always one in every bunch, you know? Yeah. Lower. Sorry, Sean. Baby. Two, two. When they do well, sometimes two, 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 they end up growing okay. bigger and stronger. Just relax, and really just relax, I know. baby. Just relax. Just relax. That's okay, too, too. Six weeks and sometimes, you know, even longer, you know, they'll, they'll still be shedding. Okay. So you're going to see, she may stand up and have a big splotch of like cloudy blood looking stuff come out, which is totally fine. They okay. all do that. She needs, she's going to shed that whole lining. Got it. How can I tell if they're getting milk? You just want to get, get them sucking right now. Though. Okay. They'll start pulling it down. Got it. And as they suck, that's going to trigger her to produce more milk. That's, okay. I I'll it. give her a little 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 touch of oxytocin before she goes. Okay. What that does is help with milk milk letdown, not production, but letdown. Okay. Their sucking is going to is going to uh, help her produce milk. Prolactin is a hormone for that one, and, and oh, they, God. that stimulates prolactin, stimulates milk production, and more. So I would maybe try to try to put the one on a nipple, to try to try to keep it keep it kind of active. Best way for it to lay is sternal. Too, on, on his belt, sternal. Got it. Is it, it. Is, is always the best way they can, they can breathe best when they're sternal. Okay. Because lungs expand up, so so on their back is the worst way for them to lay. Okay. Now the healthy strong ones will lay, lay in the back and it's totally fine because they're breathing just fine. Got but it. But for this little one for right now, I would try to keep it, if you set it down, try to do it sternal. Got it, okay. Cool. And if you have, you may have to Bottle supplement that little one a little bit. Yep. I don't know. We you got some to. stuff for it. Okay. Good. Got we got. And you have like a real slow flow type nipple. Yeah, yeah we got the nipple with the thing that so you have to suck it so it doesn't ask the little. It's like a. I, we ordered it off of uh, my pet supply. I think, okay. The yeah. little, Four little puppies. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Perfect. Oh yeah. yeah. Just a way to make sure that that she does get get some milk. Okay. Whenever you guys are ready to, I can check you out. Okay. I can do that. You can do that one. Okay. Come on. 
I excited, y'all go, y'all see it. Five pups. One is, one is having a hard time, but we we gonna make sure, we gonna make sure he pulls through. You know what I'm saying? So we actually had to drive two cars down here because, as y'all know, I made bad decision and decided to go out tonight. So we actually gonna leave my car here, and um, we going we going we gonna just drive her car, and I'll come back and get my shit whenever. But yeah, though, I'll be back. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna get the pups all loaded up, the tsunami loaded up, everything situated. When we get home, I'll probably do another, I'll probably do another video or I might just keep it keep it going. But yeah, I'll be right back. Got set up some shit. Hold on, hold on, baby. 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 Hold on, I wanted to pick you up, but I, all right, let me pick her up. Let me pick Dookie boy number two. Bruce is number one. <laughs> So right now, one of the pups is getting stimulated. So it's going, basically using, the, we're making it, well, she's making it use the bathroom. As you can see, all that shit and piss on the, is that still iodine or is that just the color of their piss now? I don't know. So basically, yeah, you just stimulate their little bottom areas with a baby wipe um, 15, 20 minutes after they're feeding and you, you should get that. They all been doing pretty good. Mama's watching Bruce. Yeah, Mama's watching. It's okay. She's actually really protective. We didn't think she was. We thought she was gonna be like a not so good mom, she's but on it. she's actually on it. She's surprising us. When you went back in the cage, it, and then we checked on him. He wasn't moving, and then I started to do CPR and press on him and do this. He didn't respond. All right, y'all. So. Exotic Frenchie Boutique. Quick update on the pups. Um, 
So y'all know we had five. Um, one of them was not like doing good. And we had the pups last night. It was about 11.30. So long story short, he did make it. He made it um, all the way until this morning. And then he just, he, man, he just couldn't hold on. I stayed up all night. I tried to do everything I could do to make sure that this didn't happen. Um, I feel like enough, I feel, I feel like I, I know I did everything I could. And it's just really sad because it's like, this is some shit that actually, this is some shit that actually has me second guessing if I want to breed animals. I want to breed dogs because I just, I just, in a sense, I just brought a life into the world. And now, I mean, granted, it's not my fault, but I couldn't save him. I couldn't do nothing for the little dude. I tried to do everything I could do, but all right, so I'm back. I got myself together a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? That shit was really emotional just because you don't want to ever see a life being lost especially if you feel or think that you could have prevented it or whatever the case may be. But I know it's part of the game, so I'm going to roll with the punches. my first litter, and we just going to really just do every and anything that we can, can do to make sure that we ensure the rest of these puppies a healthy, happy, and fun life, for real, for real, because that's really what I'm in this shit for. I'm, I'm, I'm like... I got money. If we being on some real shit, like I love Frenchies. I want other people to love Frenchies. Me and my girl, like we, m money is involved, but man, beyond the money, we love Frenchies and this is just something that we wanted to do. And I guess I just got to roll with the punches, man. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't going to get all too, too deep in the weeds about it, but it's very sad what happened. I know it happens. And I'm gonna just make sure that that shit never happens again. Or to the best of my ability, make sure that that never happens again. But I'm about to get out of here. I had to go get some coffee and shit. My girl, she taking care of the pups right now. The four. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go get back in here and get get back to caring for these guys and, and, and females.